Hi, this is Dave Barnett with LZ Tactical Lighting with another video blog. Today we're going to talk about one of those important items of tactical flashlights that is very seldom discussed or considered by people shopping for tactical flashlights, and that is aluminum alloys. Now, most Tactical flashlights today, certainly the high quality ones, are made from aluminum. And people will usually say just that. It's an aluminum flashlight. Well, when they say it's an aluminum flashlight, what they really mean is it is an aluminum alloy. In fact, very few things are made from pure elemental aluminum. And an alloy is simply a metal that is combined with another chemical. And there are dozens and dozens of different aluminum alloys. And the properties of those different alloys vary widely. Now, if you look at the chemical composition, say it's just a percent of this element being added to the aluminum shouldn't make that much difference, but in fact, it makes a tremendous difference. And we wanna look at the different factors, the different material properties that are critical to make a quality tactical flashlight and how the selection of the appropriate aluminum alloy makes a big difference in the quality of the flashlight. So let's take a few minutes and discuss some of the important material properties for designing a quality tactical flashlight. First one that probably comes to mind is strength. We want it to be very strong. And indeed, strength is important. But there are other material properties that are just as important, if not more important, than strength. Those include electrical conductivity, heat conductivity, heat capacity, and corrosion resistance. And when we look at each one of those, we can see why they are important to the construction of a true quality tactical flashlight. For example, electrical conductivity is important because the aluminum body, the aluminum components of an LZ modular flashlight, for example, form the ground plane of the circuits. So we want a high electrical conductivity so it can conduct electrical current efficiently with a minimal of resistance to have efficient electrical systems in the flashlight. Heat conductivity is important because LEDs naturally generate heat and we need to get that heat away from the LED and away from the electrical components as quickly as possible and form as much of an isothermal or even temperature system as we can possibly achieve. Similarly, heat capacity is important because it's the ability of a material to absorb heat with a minimum of temperature increase. So we want a high heat capacity so that the flashlight doesn't get overly hot. And then corrosion resistance, obviously, tactical flashlights are often used in harsh, corrosive environments, and we need a flashlight that's going to endure in those types of environments with a long life, with a minimal of corrosion and deterioration. With all of those considerations, LZ engineers looked at the different aluminum alloys available and which ones optimized those various material properties, and rightly selected alloy 6061 T6 aluminum as the best choice for making tactical flashlights. Now those of you that have some familiarity with the different aluminum alloys might say, but 7075 T6 is even stronger than 6061 T6. And indeed, if you look at strength alone, 7075 T6 is stronger than 6061 T6. But when you look at the other material properties that we talked about, you find that 6061 T6 aluminum has 28% greater electrical conductivity, 28% greater heat conductivity, and 20% greater heat capacity than 7075 T6, and it's also more corrosion resistant than 7075 T6. So when all of the factors are considered, 6061 T6 aluminum is the choice for making quality tactical flashlights. Now you hear me use that suffix T6 a lot. What does that refer to? The T6 refers to the heat treatment, and it's a very important part of the specification. For example, aluminum alloy 6061 T6 is four times stronger in yield strength than 6061 T0. So simply stating T6 aluminum is meaningless. One must specify both the alloy 6061 and the heat treat T6 to have a valid aluminum specification. Now, despite the importance of selecting the right material, the right grade of aluminum alloy, most manufacturers don't tell the consumer what alloy they make their flashlights from. And many manufacturers will blow smoke and marketing hype and say things like aerospace aluminum or aircraft grade, which are meaningless terms that tell you nothing about the specific alloy grade and the very critical material properties that go along with a particular grade of aluminum alloy. 
at Elzetta are very packaging states. Right on the front, 6061T6. That's the aluminum alloy that is optimum for quality tactical flashlights, and all LZ modular flashlights are made from that material. If you see a flashlight on the market that's blowing smoke and says something like aerospace aluminum, it probably doesn't have the right stuff.